The day started like any other in the bustling cities and quiet towns across the United States. People were immersed in their daily routines, oblivious to the looming catastrophe. Without warning, a sudden intense burst of electromagnetic energy enveloped the nation, an electromagnetic pulse or EMP attack, unseen and unheard, yet instantly transformative. The pulse, a high-intensity surge of electromagnetic energy, rendered electronic devices useless, plunging the entire country into darkness and silence. It was an unprecedented event, the likes of which the modern world had never seen. In moments, the fabric of American society began to unravel. Electricity grids, the lifelines of the nation, failed en masse, leaving millions without power. Vital communication systems collapsed, severing the links that kept communities connected. Transportation systems ground to a halt as vehicles and trains became inoperable, stranded on highways and tracks. The country found itself thrust into an era akin to pre-industrial times, but without the readiness or resilience of those bygone days. Envisioning such a scenario is daunting, yet it's crucial to understand the potential reality of an EMP attack on the United States. This is more than a theoretical discussion. It's an exploration of what could actually unfold. Join us as we delve into the tangible consequences and realities of an EMP strike, dissecting how it would reshape life as we know it. An electromagnetic pulse is a burst of electromagnetic energy capable of causing widespread disruption. It can originate from natural sources like a solar flare or be man-made, typically through a nuclear explosion at high altitude. When a nuclear device is detonated in the Earth's atmosphere, it releases gamma rays. These gamma rays collide with air molecules, producing high-energy electrons that create an EMP. This phenomenon can affect a large geographic area depending on the altitude and size of the explosion, potentially encompassing an entire continent. An EMP attack involves the intentional creation of these pulses to disrupt or destroy electronic and electrical systems. Unlike conventional attacks, an EMP attack doesn't rely on physical force or destruction. Its power lies in its ability to silently render all forms of modern electronic technology useless. It's a strategic weapon, one that could potentially cripple a nation without damaging buildings or directly harming people. The concept of an EMP attack has been part of military strategies since the discovery of the EMP effect during nuclear tests in the mid-20th century. When the EMP hits, its first and most immediate effect is on the power grid. Transformers, essential for transmitting electricity over long distances, are particularly vulnerable to the surge of energy. The loss of transformers nationwide leads to a catastrophic and prolonged power outage. Without electricity, hospitals struggle to operate, essential services like water and sewage treatment plants fail, and homes are plunged into darkness. The outage isn't just an inconvenience, it's a critical blow to the very functioning of society. The telecommunications network also collapses in the wake of an EMP. Cell towers, internet routers, and landline systems fail simultaneously. The loss of communication means people can't reach out to loved ones, emergency services are hampered, and the government struggles to coordinate a response. In today's interconnected world, the inability to communicate adds to the chaos and confusion, amplifying the sense of panic among the population. Transportation networks suffer a crippling blow. Modern vehicles with their reliance on electronic control systems become inoperable. Airplanes governed by sophisticated electronic systems are grounded, halting air travel, and causing widespread disruptions in both passenger and cargo flights. Public transportation systems, including buses and trains, stop functioning, leaving cities and towns isolated. The loss of transportation hampers the delivery of essential goods, leading to shortages of food, medicine, and other supplies. Financial systems and commerce come to a standstill. ATMs stop working, online transactions are impossible, and the flow of money, both physical and digital, is interrupted. Businesses are unable to operate, and the economy grinds to a halt. The banking system, heavily dependent on electronic records and transactions, faces a crisis of unprecedented scale. The economic impact is immediate and severe, with long-term implications for both national and global economies. In the immediate aftermath, public health becomes a pressing concern. Without power, hospitals and healthcare facilities struggle to provide care. 
life-saving equipment, from ventilators to dialysis machines, becomes non-functional. The lack of refrigeration affects the storage of medicines and vaccines. The interruption in healthcare services leads to a surge in medical emergencies, putting an immense strain on already overwhelmed healthcare professionals. The effect on individuals and communities is profound. People find themselves unprepared for a life without electricity and modern conveniences. The lack of access to basic needs like heating, cooling, and lighting leads to a dramatic shift in daily life. Communities must quickly adapt to a new way of living, relying on primitive methods for cooking, heating, and preserving food. The psychological impact is significant as the certainty of modern life gives way to a struggle for survival. In the long-term aftermath of an EMP attack, the United States faces a daunting task of rebuilding its infrastructure. The power grid, now a tangle of damaged components, requires years and unprecedented investment to restore fully. Transportation systems, vital for the movement of goods and people, need extensive repairs, further straining economic resources. The disruption of supply chains leads to chronic shortages of food, medicine, and essential goods, exacerbating public health crises and deepening social inequalities. The societal impact of the EMP attack is profound and multifaceted. Communities, stripped of their technological backbone, must adapt to a new reality where self-sufficiency becomes key to survival. Social structures are tested as people grapple with the loss of everyday conveniences and the challenge of meeting basic needs. The psychological impact is widespread with increased rates of anxiety, depression, and other mental health issues emerging as people struggle to cope with the new normal. The financial ramifications of an EMP attack are staggering with the cost of damage potentially running into trillions of dollars. Rebuilding the nation's power grid, a complex and integral part of modern infrastructure, requires a massive investment of resources and time. The transportation sector, including roads, bridges, railways, and airports, all of which rely heavily on electronic systems, faces equally daunting repair costs. Businesses across all sectors suffer significant losses due to halted operations and broken supply chains. The cumulative economic impact extends far beyond immediate repair costs, affecting long-term national and global economic stability. The damage to the telecommunications sector adds another layer of financial burden. Restoring communication networks, including internet infrastructure and cell towers, is not just expensive but critical for the nation's recovery and future resilience. The financial systems, crippled by the outage, require extensive efforts to rebuild trust and functionality, a process that incurs substantial costs and time. Industries dependent on digital technology and automation, such as manufacturing and services, face a long road to recovery, impacting the job market and overall economic health. Recovery from an EMP attack is a long and arduous journey requiring national resilience and international cooperation. The United States, in rebuilding its infrastructure, must prioritize EMP-resistant technologies to prevent future catastrophes. This process involves not only physical reconstruction, but also policy changes and innovations in technology and energy. International aid plays a crucial role, with allies offering support in resources and expertise. The recovery period is also an opportunity for the country to reinvent itself, potentially leading to a more sustainable and resilient society. While this portrayal of a post-EMP world for the United States is speculative, it highlights the profound changes and global ripple effects such an event could trigger. It serves as a compelling thought experiment, urging us to contemplate and prepare for the unforeseen challenges of our increasingly interconnected and technology-dependent world.